we are back to Dr. Klein, who speaks so very much. Uh, I will probably make these uh, following sessions a little bit shorter because I'm merely taking a break from work to play a little bit. Let's see. So, talk to me. Did you retrieve the technologies yet? We need them, as I have indicated. Yes, you have indicated. Don't strain your brain now, it's bubbling and stuff. Hmm, okay. I am Dr. Klein, Chief Head Researcher of Logistical Operations and Ideaology here at Big Mountain. I am surprised you have not heard of me. I am first <laughs> in my field, first chair as it were, back in the days of chairs. So you are the one with the Mark's beard, huh? It's a side effect of the cerebral scrubbing. It won't stop you from excreting or asking questions, apparently. I have to correct that next time. Hormonal aggressive tendencies are actively suppressed, however. They are a no-no and <laughs> not permitted in the think tank. The scrubbing also ensures your silence to keep Big Mountain safe. This facility is top secret, and you cannot speak of it to anyone outside of Big Mountain. Should have done it with the last batch, and the anti-aggression scrub. We had to take precautions after the last visitors. They caused a great deal of damage in a short time. Should have made sure they couldn't mention Big Mountain once they left. An oversight. Dr. Eight and Dr. O could tell you more. Dr. O more than Eight. The battle against the visitors damaged Eight's voice module. Suffice to say, those visitors are unwelcome. They stole a great many secrets and much technology. Impertinent. They also broke one of my <laughs> trains. Oh, poor you. That glowing red scar? That laser lobotomy <laughs> canyon maze carved in the landscape as if by some child? It is Mobius's fortress. From that hemorrhoidal fissure, he sends his amazing robo-scorpions to terrify and irritate us. <laughs> he always tended to the dramatic. Dr. Mobius was not the horrifying creature you saw upon the screen, twisted by science. He was once one of us, a friend. Of course. He researched in directions contrary to the think tank. Brains, brains, <laughs> brains, always about the brains. Brains. So we exiled him. He says he left of his own volition, but that was to save him the embarrassment. Now he sends his intelligence consuming scorpions from the Forbidden Zone to plunder the secrets of Big Mountain. He is a menace. I'm not certain. Perhaps it only affects machines. If so, you may be immune. If it is chems, then we have nothing to fear. Since we are afraid, it must not be chems, and you need not fear, which means you can test it. Logical. Great. Ask Boros. I believe he knows more about the fence than any brain. Except maybe Mobius. Mobius. Mobius was involved in their construction, if I recall. But he's such a hack, he probably was reading off Boros's notes and schematics. Well, we didn't <laughs> actually do it. We tried to clean up after, as always, but usually the auto-dock runs are remote. But we programmed it, or Mobius did. Still, this new wrinkle with the Tesla coils in your skull was unexpected. I mean, we predicted we'd have a breakthrough <laughs> eventually, but... Of course Dalla you did. knows more. She supervised your spine peel and the heart circumcision, <laughs> then dumped them both into the tanks in the sink above. Quite sanitary. Sure took her time. <laughs> it takes longer than projected with lobotomite surgeries. Not sure why. 
Yes. In all probable likelihoods, yes. Possibly. That it may have gone to Mobius is merely an inkling. I don't know why, but it may be something involving the surgery code. Actually, I don't know. All I know is it misplaced itself. Or it mm -hmm. floated off. They get into robots sometimes and go on a tear. Great. Yes. Always leaves back doors into things. Have to keep finding them and closing them. The auto dock is now erased of his routines. It was thorough. Only Mobius would know for sure what happened with the procedure. Perhaps. Well, and your <laughs> brain, of course. It would know as well. Aha. Uh -huh. Right now I'm imagining that Mobius has this big depository of runaway brains. It can communicate the procedure when we examine it. It is conceivable to trace its surgical scalpel prints once we have the brain. Might take some time, but your brain has no pain nerve to scream at us while we <laughs> dissect it. Convenient. I detest screaming in my lab. Mobius's legacy code was in the old auto dock. Yes, it fried itself after your procedure so he couldn't tell for sure. It is unfortunate. We would have benefited from knowing how the breakthrough occurred. Even if we installed another chip, the information is lost. Why does he seek our destruction? Why did he build robot scorpions with intelligence training stingers? It is because he hasn't cleaned his biogel in a long time. Clearly he's got some sort of psychological corrosion. He's mad. <laughs> and you aren't right. Okay. Dr. O is certain of his findings. And no one else in the think tank is willing to test the results. Loss of brainial power. Terrifying. O has said on many occasions his inability to comprehend Mobius's robo-schematics is because of repeated robo-scorpion <laughs> stings. Okay, and let's, let's ask about the mountain as well. This oh. is the think oh, tank. The nerve center of Big Mountain. The greatest research center known to man and to us. Here we test and test and test some more <laughs> in the name of science. science, atomic power, nuclear power, and scientific power. Science. Yes, because the intellectually challenged see an M and a T next to each other and take Occam's razor to it. <laughs> While you are here, you will refer to this place properly. And you will do the same with the other scientists here. Scientists. Okay. Yes, a most goodbye. <laughs> huh. I wonder where can I find these uh, client clothes that I have been hearing about. Oh no, teddy bears, that's all of them. And the hats. Oh, poor baby. Can't look in the mirror. Wait, wasn't one of the quests finding dollar body now. Let's see. Not that. Not that. Okay, that's...
So yeah, I can it's... hear your penis tit feet tromping around. <laughs> sure you can. You know, these walkie-talkies look quite penisy too. indeed oh steady Someone has got an obsession with Nuka Cola. So one brain's a pervert, one is a drunk, one is mad, one is oh yeah. I'm gonna take this too now. The lobotomite returns! <laughs> what insidious plan can it have brewing in its horrid mind? What commie anti-American propaganda will it spew? I'm gonna steal your girlfriend, you know. Um, I wanna hear more about Night Stalkers, but... The radar fence protects us all. If evidence is correct, the one who built <laughs> it is me. me it keeps me. anything with a disembodied brain inside, like us. And anything without <laughs> a brain, also inside. It is the ultimate <laughs> defense against communist aggression. There'll be no infectious ideas on my watch. Trapped? Nonsense! <laughs> we are secure here from evil philosophies. Ever since my anxiety-filled days of powerlessness and being bullied in American <laughs> high school, I have dreamed of such security as the fence. That and giant cybernetic dogs that would ruthlessly patrol and kill anyone who was <laughs> my friend. Like Richie Marcus and Betsy Bright. Who's laughing now, Betsy? I hope you and Richie are happy smoking in your radioactive coffins. Yeah, yeah, I'm heard that. glad you never came to my birthday party. No! Beyond is death, despite <laughs> mounting evidence to the contrary. No matter where these strange humans wander in from with their ideas and new brains, there is nothing beyond Big Mountain. Enough! Stop filling my precious brain cell units with irrelevant data. <laughs> 
You sound like the other visitors, making wild claims of a world beyond, where there is a war beyond war. It is unproven and unthinkable. Bother the other doctors <laughs> with your crackpot theories. I have no time. None of us do. Wait, where is the place where I can ask him to give me just one fact? Uh, da 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 da. Quarantine, right, revenge, Mobius. Are you going to talk about animals now? Before you is the brain of Dr. Boros, head of animology, bestology, and DNA scrambling technology Bestiality. here at Big Mountain. I lay the bones and hearts of animals bare beneath my searing gaze, especially the dogs. <laughs> I did so love dogs once, especially Gabe, that rascal. <laughs> but there are many animals to shape. Industrious Cazadors, the happy-go-lucky Night Stalkers, they are my living, breathing DNA test tubes. Oh. Indeed. Docile. Curious. <laughs> safe. Sterile. They are contained here at Big Mountain to preserve DNA and for observation. I cannot expect a lobotomite to understand the careful surgical castrating procedures used in their creation. Perhaps a demonstration of my castrating power would settle your doubts. You are one power hungry fucker, aren't you? Hmm. Because Big Mountain safety big measures mountain. are far more sophisticated than their primitive animal instincts. We are their <laughs> lords and masters. Wait. I think this is the dialogue tree where I get to the fact thing. No. Such creatures are found only here. For research purposes. They would no more be capable of escape <laughs> than breeding. Ah, no. Okay. Until next time, then. Provided there is a next time. For any of us. Eight seems friendliest of them all. I'm blinking at him right now. Hmm, wait, was there something else that Dala knew? Important. And you return as curious as a teddy bear. Are you stuck in a living <laughs> gesture of greeting? I can pick my nose for you if you want to. Looping, yes. It is a scientific fact that hormones drive a percentage of lobotomites into recursive behavior patterns. We haven't researched this, as my colleagues care little about the behavior patterns of lobotomites once their brains are removed. It is why so many are littered around the facility, like skin envelopes, discarded after they are peeled open and the contents extracted. And where did their brains go? Hmm? It varies according to the number and density of lobotomites that have infected an area. In 43% of observed cases, true lobotomites left alone will fight for dominance or inject bodily fluids into each other's orifices. Unsanitary. I have tried to observe more cases, but subjects seem unwilling to release bodily fluids in my presence. I don't think I have any new questions right Until now. Until our next interaction, my intriguing little lobotomite. Perv. <laughs> uh.
I don't understand how you can stand those leg things. Yep. Ah, predictable. The lobotomite specimen returns. Its purpose? Repetition. <laughs> Chances of success? High. Um... Until our next scheduled audio transmission and reception, then. Are there new materials in here? Nope. Oh. <gasps> Wait a second. Now I have a bit of clients uh, stuff. Oh, it's depleted. Damn it. So let's go outside then. To the unsanitary. Sip up tea. I wanted to just roam around, but I also want to find my brain. Reading sterile. Whoa, <laughs> fucker. Whoa, where did you come from? Are they coming from the ground? Sterile my ass. Hmm. That was fast. Let's try it again. I certainly want to take a closer look at those um, holes or ground thingies where I think they came out from. Wow! What the fuck? 
fuck is shooting me? And from where? Oh, here! Ah, you fucker. Ah! Stupid. Oh yeah, thumbs up. Does this guy have some different kind of headgear? Oh no. No, I want to drink it, not to drop it. Ow. Ow! Fuck. Oh no, oh, I haven't picked up the mask yet. Where did you go, doggy? So these scraps are probably the best uh, best armor around. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Doggy. Uh oh. Haha. <laughs> 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 Shut up, Klein. Intelligence to devour and stupefy. Terrain here over here. Ah, oh, that's the platform where, where I got uh, my very first trip outside. Um, this shack I couldn't get into. Is so much better. Wait a second. Nah. I thought I could spot a few of them mounting each other again, but apparently not. I have my light on. I don't usually use my light. me F fucking fucker ah oh fuck so much 
much about higher ground. Come on. Here, boy. Okay, and the other doggy. Hmm, line up, please. Police. I'm gonna exploit the chat chat as long as it lasts. <laughs>
Let's bring them on. What's on there? Some train thing going on. Oh, I can't pass this. How am I going to get to that truck then? Um, I don't know if you have noticed, but this this truck is inside the rock. Uh-oh. Oh, the chip is still having effect. <gasps> oh, there are so many of these. Fuck, 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 get away from me. Oh! Don't tell me I'm stuck again. Oh. <laughs> 